This video explains how to merge a list of pandas data frames using the Python programming language. So without too much talk, let's dive into the Python code. As a first step in this video, we need to create some example data. And we can do that by first importing the pandas library. And then we can use the data frame constructor to create different data frames, as you can see in the first code box. So after running these lines of code, three new data frames are created, which are called data1, data2, and data3. In the next step, I'm creating a list of these pandas data frames, as you can see in the second code box. So in this code box, I'm creating a list which is called data list, and I'm also printing this list below the code box. So as you can see below this code box, we have created a list of three pandas data frames, which is called data list. In the next step, I want to merge these data frames into a single data frame. And for this, we first need to import reduce from the func tools library. And then in the next step, we can use the reduce function. And within this function, we need to specify lambda left right. And then we can use the merge function of the pandas library to merge our data frame that is stored in our list object. In this case, I'm using an outer join. However, you could also apply different kinds of joins using this syntax. So after running these lines of code, a new data frame, which is called data merge, is created. And we can print this data frame below the code box by using the print function. And then you can see that we have combined all the three data frames in our input list in a single data frame object. That's all I wanted to explain in this video. In case you want to learn more on this topic, you may check out my homepage, statisticsglobe.com, because on my homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video, so you can find it there. If you have liked this video or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. I'll try to respond to all comments as soon as I can. Furthermore, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notified about future video releases. I have already published about 500 videos on this channel and I'm releasing new videos on a daily basis. Thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next video.